Welcome to Camera Basics on MediaStone. Today we're going to be taking a look at the inner workings of any SLR camera. This includes both analog and digital cameras. This model in particular is a digital SLR camera or a DSLR. This will be solely based in the camera body so we can get rid of that lens. There are three main components involved in the picture taking process. First we have the mirror which is responsible for directing light to the viewer's eye. Then we have the shutter, which moderates the amount of time a single picture is exposing for. And lastly, we have the image sensor, which converts light into a digital signal that is delivered in the form of a picture. When the camera is on standby, the mirror directs light up into the pentamirror, which then guides the light through the viewfinder for our viewing pleasure. However, when you trigger the camera to take a picture, the mirror will pivot upwards, allowing light to pass behind it, and the first shutter curtain will open, allowing light to hit the image sensor. This is when we begin to expose our picture. The picture is finished exposing when the second shutter curtain closes and light is cut off to the image sensor. Then, the mirror will pivot back to its standby position and the shutter will reset itself for the next picture. An SOR camera works exactly the same way, only instead of an image sensor, it captures its images onto film. Thank you for watching. You can check out some of our other videos here.